Well, we have this giant squid, it's a giant deep sea squid, and this came about as a result of a partnership between the Institute for Applied Ecology New Zealand, which is one of the research institutes at AUT University, and NIWA. We want to look in particular at some hard parts of the animal that might tell us a little bit about um, the animal's age, which is still very much an unknown for this species. Um, no one really knows how long giant squids live, but they have a couple of structures in the body that have growth rings, like trees. Uh, we'll be looking at some dietary work as well. If there are stomach contents, we can find out a bit more about what they eat uh, and understand their position in marine food webs a bit better. These animals live in the deep sea, which is actually very poorly known. We are learning more about it all the time, um, but we actually know more about the surface of the moon and the surface of Mars than we know about the sea floor. The deep sea has been sampled about 5%, perhaps, at, at a generous estimate, uh, and considering that that's the largest habitat on the planet by far, uh, it, every little piece of insight we can gain into it is very helpful. The Institute has a mission to carry out research with direct relevance to New Zealand's natural environment. Here at AUT, we have a philosophy of engaging our students in our research. That means they get hands-on experience, and in this case, that means handling a giant squid. 